In today's video, we are doing some laundry stripping. I am specifically focusing on our towels. However, I am so excited because this video is in collaboration with the beautiful Kat Craig. Here is her channel. She focuses on motherhood and lifestyle. Kat, thank you so much for doing this collaboration with me. I am so excited to be doing this. If you guys are coming over from Kat's channel, thank you so, so, so much. Here on my channel, I do all things mom related, beauty, lifestyle, and cleaning. I cannot wait to get to know each and every one of you. Let's go ahead and get on into the video. Alrighty guys, you are going to need one fourth cup of Arm & Hammer baking soda, one fourth cup of borax, and hot, hot, hot water. You can do this in your sink if you have a big sink. You can do this in your bathtub. I am using my bathtub and the water is hot. You are also going to need a hefty scoop of Tide powder detergent. Do not forget that, that is a very important step to this. Make sure whatever it is that you are going to be stripping is clean. It does not have to be dry. However, all of my towels are dry because they are freshly cleaned. You are going to put them into the super hot water with the mixture of those three ingredients I gave you. You will mix them up and every 30 minutes or so, you want to go in and mix up the water, the detergent, the borax, and the baking soda. That way you are making sure to keep everything moving that way it can get all of the bacteria, all of the buildup, all of the debris off of those towels, or better yet, whatever it is that you are stripping. Every time I went back into the bathroom to move the towels around in the bathtub, you guys, the water got so disgusting. Every single time I went in, I was completely shocked. Like, what the heck? These are clean towels, and we are using these towels to dry off our bodies after we have bathed. And clearly, clearly, they are not as clean as we think that they are after washing them in our washing machines.
So this is a pretty long process. You want to start out with the laundry stripping with super, super, super hot water and those three ingredients that I gave you. You're going to swish your laundry around multiple times throughout this process and you do not want to remove your laundry until the water is back to a cooler temperature. Once the water is cooler, you can wring everything out, put it in a basket, a bin, whatever it is that you have. That way you can take it to your laundry room because you are going to want to wash this laundry again. When I washed mine, I did not use any extra laundry detergent just because I had pulled all of the buildup from other laundry detergents and all of the debris and skin particles and whatever it is that is built up on our towels off. So I did not want to use any extra laundry detergent, so I did not. I am so thankful that Taya came in here to help me because you guys, this process was gruesome. I thought that I was pretty tough, like pretty strong, but this was a miserable process. I'm so glad I did it. However, if I do it again, which I will be doing it again because I have plenty of laundry that needs to be stripped, I will have my husband do this part of getting all of the excess water off of whatever it is that we are stripping because you guys my back hurt my arms hurt my legs hurt maybe it's because i have multiple sclerosis i don't know but this process was miserable so my husband will be doing it next time You guys, I can't even lie. Just the thought of wringing this dirty water out of my towels had me so grossed out. Taya and I were just talking back and forth about how disgusting this is and what is actually in that water. Like, uh, it baffles me that we think that we're cleaning our clothes and clearly, clearly, we are not cleaning them like we think we are cleaning them. I, I honestly, I can't wrap my brain around how disturbing this is. <laughs>
Also, this portion of wringing out all of the towels took us a good 30 minutes. So it might look like it's so much fun because we're laughing and we're bantering back and forth. But you guys, this was not the most enjoyable thing I have ever done. Like I said previously, I'm so thankful I did it. Um, I'm, I'm thankful to have this load of towels done, but we are a family of six and we are not short on towels, which means I have my hands full over the next couple of days, weeks, potentially months. Let's just hope it's days. Pray for me. Kat, I hope you don't show me up and have like crystal clear water because I will be humiliated. I'm pretty sure this is real life. I'm pretty sure everybody's looks, you know, somewhat similar. However, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I can't wait to see your video, Kat, to, to see what your water looks like at the end of all of this. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and bring this video to a close. Kat, I am so thankful that you did this collaboration with me. I'm so excited to get to know you more. And thank you guys for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And do not forget to go to Kat's channel and watch her video and subscribe and comment. You guys, after I pulled these towels out of the dryer, they felt almost brand new. They smelt so stinking good. And, well, I'm definitely going to be using these towels to dry off my body when I shower tonight after doing this video. Anywho, guys, have a fabulous day. I cannot wait to see you in my next video that will be going up on Friday. Have a beautiful, beautiful Tuesday. Love you all so very much. Bye, guys.